we have designed a solar tracker project for detecting the movement of sun from east to west direction that is when the sun rotates from east to west the solar panel also rotates so maximum auto energy can be received so for this we need arduino uno board servo motor of 9g we need a push button and we need a register of 10 kilo ohm means total three registers so this is a circuit diagram we have interface servo motor and ldr with the arduino with the help of a push button so two sensors ld wire 1 and 2 are connected to analog pin A0 and A1 and servo motor is connected to pin number 10. So this is how the car board should be placed on the top of the servo motor that is a card that will be written as east and west that should be placed at the top of the servo motor and you can see this is a barrier long barrier that is placed between two LDR. So this is how the project is designed explained. In first cases, sun is in the left side of the project. So the rotation of servo will be in anti-clockwise direction. Same the case when there is at the middle point, there is no rotation. Similarly, at the right first position, the rotation will be in clockwise direction. So this is how we have designed this project. This is the Arduino Uno board as shown in the circuit diagram. Two LDR placed left and right, and between the LDR there is a barrier, and this is a servo motor, and the cop is let sorry, a cop board is cardboard is placed at the top of the servo motor and pasted with the super glue. So you can see three resistors, all of them are up to kilo ohm. This is LDR one, both are connected across ten kilo ohm resistors. And you can also see the push button. Now we'll simply demonstrate the project with the help of a light. In this example, we'll take the light of a mobile as a sun. Since we need a some source of light. So this is the light that is blown. Now we'll supply the light at the pulse in LDR so you can see whenever light is detected at one end more and less means there is a competition between the quantity of light falling on case of LDR now this is done to the Arduino program so you can see the rotation the LDR which receives more light will rotate the motor in its opposite direction so this is the programming section you can see this is the header file for storing the program means whenever you will start a project a switch button is placed that will store the program detecting upon the quantity of light falling on LDR and hatch includes servo is for servo motor uh, we have defined the pin number A1 and A0 of Arduino with LDR this is a call switch for selecting the most motion direction so sensor 1 sensor 2 and call switch is the input pin so you can see the competition is done between the uh, quantity of light falling on sensor 1 and sensor 2 as VAL1 and VAL2 this is the competition of VAL1 is greater than VAL2 So you can see this is a program that is defined by comparing the value with the quantity of light falling on servo motor. So this was all about the project. Thank you for watching.